is Matt Beck from FreeSalonEducation.com. We're gonna work on step number nine in 14 steps to cutting hair better. Right now, we're gonna work on cross-checking. Real quick, not much to it, but what we did was we went in and we cut a graduation just in the back half of the head here. So as I was working, I was working on diagonal forward sectioning, keeping those sections consistent. That's what we focus on in step eight. Now what I want to do is because I was working diagonal forward, now I want to go through and I'm going to cross check working diagonal back. Now cross checking, the key to this, and I know a lot of us don't do this that as often as we should, but we're, as we're working here, I'm going to overdirect diagonal back and just follow the same line that I created. So if everything was coming straight back in the head, that's how I want to pull it back to cross check. I worked diagonal forward, now I'm working diagonal back, just doing everything opposite. Now if you find a piece of hair that doesn't look right, you need to go through and cut it back the original way. And the reason for that is, let's say I go in here and I cut this and I mess up one of these sections and I make it a little bit too long. What's going to happen when I go through and I cross check it? I'm only working with a little tiny bit of that section. So if I go through and I clean up just that part, there's still that whole part of the section that I, I left in there. So that doesn't correct it. That just shows you where you needed to go back and fix. So if you go through and you cross check, just make sure that that's not how you're correcting it. That's just how you're checking it. Now, I'm still obviously, as I work to this side, I'm gonna work diagonal back as well. The other key to cross checking is don't pull all this hair up at once to check it. You're not going to see a line in there because again, you're smashing all that hair together. You're creating all different kinds of lines. So make sure when you cross check, if you took half inch sections diagonal forward, you take half inch sections diagonal back and you'll be more successful with your haircuts. So hope this helps you guys. We'll move on to step number 10. Thank you so much. We'll see you next time. FreeSalonEducation.com.